Understanding Conforming Loans, a simple guide for learners. Hello and welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore the meaning of the phrase, conforming loan. This term is often used in finance, especially in relation to mortgages and home buying. Understanding this concept can be incredibly useful, especially if you are interested in the world of finance or planning to buy a house. Let's dive in. A conforming loan is a type of mortgage that meets specific criteria set by government-sponsored entities. These criteria include the maximum loan amount, credit requirements, and down payment. Conforming loans are attractive because they often come with lower interest rates and are considered less risky for lenders. They are called conforming because they conform or adhere to these established standards. Understanding conforming loans is crucial when you're looking to buy a house. They are widely available and offer more favorable terms compared to non-conforming loans, like jumbo loans, which are for larger amounts and often come with higher interest rates. For a borrower, getting a conforming loan can mean easier qualification and lower monthly payments. 1. Loan Limits the maximum amount for a conforming loan changes yearly and varies by location. 2. Credit score requirements. Borrowers typically need a good credit score to qualify. 3. Down payment. Conforming loans often require a smaller down payment compared to other types of mortgages. 4. Interest rates. Generally, these loans have lower interest rates, making them more affordable. It's important to understand the difference between these two. Non-conforming loans don't meet the criteria set by government-sponsored entities and often cater to individuals with unique financial situations, like self-employed people or those with irregular incomes. They usually have higher interest rates and stricter lending criteria. I hope this video has helped clarify what a conforming loan is and why it's an important term in the financial world, especially for prospective homeowners. Remember, understanding these concepts can be a big step towards making informed financial decisions. Thanks for watching, and see you in our next lesson.